Well, the upward trend continues. 74 more people died from coronavirus in our state in just 24 hours as more cases are reported here. But hospitalization remains steady. Hello, everyone. I'm Nicole Baker. And I'm Vic Carter. Governor Hogan is focused on the number of people hospitalized as we all look forward to things reopening. Now, there is a sign of change tonight. The beach and boardwalk in Ocean City will open again this weekend with some restrictions and no pushback from the governor. We have extensive live team coverage tonight. Our reporting begins with WJC investigator Mike Helgren and Ocean City's mayor on his decision. Mike. Vic and Nicole, Ocean City's mayor does not believe this violates any part of the stay at home order, yet he acknowledges that people may be coming in from the Baltimore area and from out of state, and he says police will not stop them. There will be no police officers patrolling for license plates. Ocean City Mayor Rick Meehan announced beaches and the boardwalk in the Maryland Beach Resort will reopen Saturday, earlier than expected. He said police will enforce social distancing, but will not turn away out-of-town visitors, particularly those with beach homes here. We do expect people to, from the surrounding areas and some of those, some of the areas to, to come into Ocean City. Uh, quite honestly, they've probably been coming here already. Hotels and short-term rentals will still only be available to essential workers, and restaurants will only offer carryout. Just because the beach is open, maybe you don't feel comfortable going to the beach, don't go to the beach. Mayor Meehan said repeatedly this does not violate Governor Hogan's stay-at-home order. We are not asking anyone to supersede the travel restrictions that are in place. The eastern shore is dealing with outbreaks among poultry workers, and Hogan said two weeks ago he was opposed to only reopening parts of the state. What we don't want is to have the neighbor next door come over. If you open up everything, then they're going to be flooded with more infected folks. The mayor says masks will not be required on the beach, and signs will go up reminding people to social distance. And if people don't follow the rules, he will reevaluate his decision. We want to work our way towards larger crowds. And we think this will give us an opportunity to do so. While Maryland's hospitalization numbers have remained stable, the state tied its daily record for deaths at 74. There are so many bodies, an ice rink in Laurel has been turned into a temporary morgue. Still, Ocean City's mayor says he does not believe opening the beaches will put people in danger. Is there a perfect answer to anything that we do in these unprecedented times? Probably not. But we're going to have to move forward. And Governor Hogan has yet to announce when Maryland will begin its first phase of reopening. But he does have a press briefing scheduled for tomorrow at 3 in the afternoon from the State House. Reporting live, Mike Helgren, WJZ.